Grace and peace on the second day of our Holy Week. We join you again this morning in an opportunity to reflect on the Song of Ascent found in the Book of Psalms. We're gathering each day to reflect on these scripture passages, to pray together, and then we invite you to stay around at the end and you'll find in our playlist that there's a song that we encourage you to listen to also to connect with the psalm and the prayer as a point of reflection. Hear these words from Psalm 122. This is a song of praise in prayer for Jerusalem, a song of a sense of David. I was glad when they said to me, let us go to the house of the Lord. Our feet are standing within your gates, O Jerusalem. Jerusalem, built as a city that is bound firmly together. To it the tribes go up, the tribes of the Lord, as was decreed for Israel, to give thanks to the name of the Lord. For there the thrones for judgment were set up, the thrones of the house of David. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. May they prosper who love you. Peace be within your walls and security within your towers. For the sake of my relatives and friends, I will say, peace be within you. For the sake of the house of the Lord our God, I will seek your good. And then hear that same psalm again from Eugene Peterson's paraphrase, The Message. When they said, Let's go to the house of God. My heart leaped for joy. And now we're here, O oh Jerusalem, inside Jerusalem's walls. Jerusalem, well-built city, built as a place for worship. The city to which the tribes ascend, all God's tribes go up to worship, to give thanks to the name of God. That is what it means to be Israel. Thrones for righteous judgment are set there. Famous David thrones. Pray for Jerusalem's peace. Prosperity to all you Jerusalem lovers. Friendly insiders, get along. Hostile outsiders, keep your distance. For the sake of my family and my friends, I say it again, live in peace. For the sake of the house of our God, I'll do my very best for you. And together we use these words from Psalm 22, 122 as our guide for prayer today. Please pray with me. God of Shalom, you desire to fill this earth with your peace. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem and for the peace of every city in your big world. We pray for peace for our family members and our relatives for those whom we love and hold close to our hearts. We pray for peace for our region, for Northwest Iowa, for our country, the United States of America, for our world, God, may you grant your peace. God, we pray for your peace for those who are struggling with COVID-19, for those who are hospitalized, for those who are on ventilators, for those who are gasping for air, we pray for your peace for their family members who are unable to be with them, whose hearts are heavy. We pray for your peace. And 
And we pray for your peace for those who have died, who have lost their lives due to COVID-19 or to some other disease. God, we pray for those who are struck down in the throes of grief. Shower them with your mercy. Shower them with your grace. Remind them that you are a one who is well acquainted with suffering and death. And bring them to the light of everlasting peace through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. God of shalom and God of peace, grant your peace to all those who are listening and praying this morning. It's in the name of Christ we pray. Amen. Go in peace, friends. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. May you experience God's shalom today.